Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Felicia. If you're new here, thank you so much for stopping in. And for all my returning subscribers, you already know, you are fabulous. Well, in today's video, I am going to be continuing my spring decorating series and this will be part five. We could be good friends, yeah, we could be good friends We could be good friends, we could be good friends going to be showing you how to do a very easy and simple DIY. After you see this, you should be able to duplicate it and make it even better in your home. So this is my fireplace mantle and this is what we're going to be decorating today along with the hearth and the huge mirror in the center came from Kirtland's. I've had it for about two years now, I think, and the shutters on each side came from Hobby Lobby. I got them on sale as well, and they actually have them in this year because I've seen them in Hobby Lobby. And we're going to be addressing the mirror. I'm going to add a wreath there, and I'm also going to do my mantle a little bit different this year. Everything has been cleaned, so we're starting with a blank slate. I am going to keep my fireplace mantle pretty neutralized this season, and with a pop of pastel colors here and there. So let's get started. So the first item that I've added to my mantle are these two buffet lamps. I typically don't use lamps on my fireplace mantle because I don't like the hanging cords, but I decided to do it for the spring season. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to address the center portion of that mirror and I'm going to add a full arrangement in the center. This is the full arrangement that I have added to my mantle and I'm going to give you a closer view so you can see what it looks like. So this is different from what I normally do for my mantle because typically for the spring and summer season I feel the entire mantle full of florals and this time I just decided to use this tray the dominant color that I used through this tray were these white florals here. I used different sizes and different textures. These are the white lighted flowers that I had during Valentine's Day, so I placed those in there. And as you can see, there are sprigs of lavender that are here. Then I have this soft green here. And so I wanted to keep it neutral. And I also put in some little berries, as you can see right here. I love decorating with those. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna insert some little bunny rabbits in here. This is the riser that I'm gonna be using to add my bunny inside the floor arrangement. It came from the Target Dollar Spot. So let's get that added. So I'm gonna be adding these brown wood rabbits that I purchased from my Target Dollar Spot this year. This is the large size, and I'm going to place two in the full arrangement. Okay, you guys, as you can see, I have added in both my rabbits here. I have one standing and one sitting. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to add in a wreath. So now I'm just gonna add some pillows to each of my captain chairs. So now for my simple DIY, I am just gonna take this simple basket here and I'm gonna add some green garland, which is, this is my favorite garland that I like to use. I call it celery garland. It really doesn't have a name on it. It just comes from Hobby Lobby. And I'm gonna be using these colorful pastel eggs here. And I purchased these from New River Pottery. They were on a super duper clearance. I got them for 50 cents, maybe two years ago. And I also have some assortment of these little Easter eggs here. They're in the neutral color tone, so I'm going to be using the greens and the whites. And so let's get started. 
So what I did to stuff this basket at the base, I just added these simple shopping bags that I had left over. I just bunched them up and put them in the bottom. So now I'm just adding in my garland, just fluffing it out and making sure it's spread out. I'm also adding in these large, colorful Easter eggs. And I'm also going to add in some smaller Easter eggs for variety and dimension. I hope you all have been enjoying my spring decorating series so far. It has been so much fun um, putting it all together. And if you haven't, I encourage you to go over and check out all my other spring decorating videos. So now I have three of these hanging on the outside of this basket. So I decided to take some leftover burlap and create this little messy bow here to give it some more visual interest. Now I'm gonna go ahead and mount it on my bar stool. You look at me like I'm crazy. When I shut my feelings out You look at me like I'm different Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you I, 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 I fell in love with your colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are and the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Stay We fly around like paper planes They never know where we will fall Nobody can see us Still they wanna tear us apart There's something different about the way we are if you enjoyed this video today, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you would like to become a part of the Felicia by the Seasons family, in which I would love to have you here, just Click that subscribe button. It's absolutely free to you, but we'll push this video out to all those people that have not found this channel yet. So until the next video, happy decorating. Bye guys.